ourselves, we're laid back, go with the flow, free spirited, just people can be drawn to us because of our black sheep nature. They want to understand us, but it is difficult because sometimes we don't even understand ourselves. Uh, a lot of people see us as eccentric, eccentric. Yeah, I said that right. Eccentric to ourselves. We are just free spirited. Don't want to be in a box. Rebel in some type of ways and just really not the norm, you know, to ourselves. That's how we see ourselves and how we how we go about when it comes to in these internal things. And now that we've discussed that, let's move on to you didn't hear that let's move on to cancer yes my cancer son you know all right so what it is like being a cancer son we're we some sweethearts i don't care what nobody tell you about cancer we we are sweethearts especially when we're healed and we are super in tune with that feminine side whether you're a male or a female just once you're in tune with that feminine side and you're, you are healed, we are just sweethearts, you know? We're, we're just that type of people. Um, cancer, the cancer sign is very, it's nurturing already. It's, it's just a part of it. Cancers are the mother of the zodiac, so nurturing is already us. And then cancer, its element is water. And if you know certain deities or certain goddesses, one that I happen to admire, Yemoja. She is a water goddess as well as Ma, part of Ma and Lisa. They are both like water goddesses who deal with nurturing and feminicity and all that divine peacefulness, cancer type of feelings, especially Ma, because she's um, a moon goddess. So she definitely deals with the rivers and the seas and nurturing and all that great stuff i just want to give her a shout out because i'm definitely heavily in tune with that um yeah oh i almost forgot to give you guys a feel of what it's like or, or what cancer sons are like here are some celebrities that you may or may not know to be cancers one starting with sweetie Yes, rapper Sweetie, Solange knows, uh, who is also a child of Yemoja, okay? Um, who, who, who else is a Cancer? Ariana Grande, um, Will Ferrell, um, and also 50 Cent. For some of y'all to be like, what? I thought you said Cancers were sweethearts. Well, not all Cancers that are healed are all sweethearts, okay? You know, not, it's not always, I'm pretty sure you know somewhere in that there there is a sweetheart but i mean we're only getting what we see so that was my child i gotta check back there also you'll be seeing my son in these from time to time because you know he decided i'm gonna be outside too um another thing that plays into factors when it comes to cancers and where you are on the sweetheart chart um definitely uh i would say is like where your house sits so you have a sign for each personality trait that you have within you within each sign and then each of those have like a house in which they sit in and um with my cancer son the house of it is in the sixth so i'm very aware of my emotions and how my emotions affect people and, and as far as how to be emotionally stable. So that's why you get this emotionally stable sweetheart cancer. Um, it's different for everyone, you know, you can, it, it just depends on where everything aligns. You know, the universe creates us all so uniquely. Cancers also can be known to be very moody. Cancers is connected to the planet moon, that is our planet. and if you know anything about the moon, the moon changes its sign every two to three days. So some cancers definitely can be moody if they are not aware of their emotions or how the, their emotions affect them or other people. 
uh, that can definitely be seen as a tray. Everything just really depends on the placement. So with that being said, let's move along to Scorpio and the Scorpio moon and what that's like to be deep in emotions with Scorpio moons. Oh my.